Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today, we're going to learn about simplifying radical equations. So, if I was given this to simplify, the square root of 5 twelfths m to the third power. Okay? So, I need to break down 5 twelfths. I'll do my prime factorization of that. 5 twelfths is 2 times 256. Okay? Let's just keep going from here. 256, I just did a similar problem. 256 was 2 times 128. And if again, you know your computers, this is easy. Uh, 2, 128 is 2 and 64, 64 is 2 and 32, and 32 is 2 and 16, and 16 is 2 and 8, 8 is 2 and 4, and 4 is 2 and 2. So I broke this down, 5 twelve to all the prime numbers I could, and we multiplied together to get 5 twelve, which is 2 times 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 2. Times two. Yeah. M to the third power could be broken down to m times m times m, right? m to the third is m times m times m. And so now, we're going to grab our pairs. I'm going to circle a pair of two. So I have one pair of two here, two pairs of two, three pairs of two, and four pairs of two. m's, I have one pair of m's, okay? So now that I've circled my pairs, okay? I'm going to put them on the outside. So every pair represents one, two on the outside. So we have two on the outside, one, two. This first one, got that one, times the second two, times the third two, oh, the three, why well, I say three, but one, two there, third two, and the last two right there, okay? Then we have one pair of M that we circled, so we have one on the outside, and on the inside, we're left with just the lone singles, two and the M, two times M, and there we go. We have it kind of simplified out here, all right? What's left on the inside was the single uh, singles that were not paired up, and then the pairs uh, combined to be on the outside, right? Because it represent one person on the outside, or one person, one number on the outside. So 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 is 8, times 2 is 16. So we have 16m on the outside, times the square root of 2m on the inside. And that is our final answer, simplify. So let's recap. We're going to 5, 12, m to the third power, and we need to take the square root of that. We did a prime factorization of 5, 12, and we got 2 times 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 2. And uh, prime factorization of m to the third power, which is m times m times m. We then circled our pairs. We had four pairs of twos and one pair of m's. Every time we circled it, we put one of the numbers on the outside of the square root. So uh, we were left with four pairs of twos, so they're represented right here. That's two times two times two times two, and one pair of m's right there. That m. Inside the square root was left the singles, the ones that weren't circled, the square root of two times m. So it's again it's multiplication there, and then we simplified. 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 is 16, and so our final answer here, uh, simplified, is 16m times the square root of 2.